Hello and welcome to a further video of the XKP series. In this video we will show you how easy it is to license your XKP in just a few steps. When the XKP is not yet installed or configured, we recommend the previous videos in this series. For this you merely require an installed XKP and a valid LOD key. This is a numeric activation code which is needed to generate the final license. You probably know the following situation. When purchasing new hardware, the test of operational safety and interoperability in advance is rather difficult. A software solution like the XCARPY saves you a lot of time and trouble. With the XCARPY you can directly test your PBX and hardware environment for interoperability without shipping times. For this, XCARPY after installing and without a license works automatically in demo mode. You can test four concurrent voice and fax channels free of charge and without any obligations. The demo mode introduces an announcement into the audio stream. This is a limited demonstrational version. And an informational demo banner is copied into all fax documents. TE Systems also offers free trial licenses which you can request from us. This allows testing the XCAPI for example 30 days without the mentioned restrictions. Please contact your XCAPI partner or send us an email to sales at tesystems.de. The demo version can be converted to a full version of the XCAPI without the need for reinstalling. Another advantage of our conventional hardware solutions is the possibility to extend the license at any time depending on the requirements of your company. For this, XCAPI extensions and add-on modules are available. So you only pay for what you really need. The XCAPI license issued is not limited in time. If you always want to keep your XCAPI updated and therefore stay on the cutting edge of technology, we do recommend our software upgrade service. It offers you the possibility to update your XCAPI at any time, ensuring compatibility with new PBX systems or operating systems. Each new purchased XCAPI license automatically includes a one-year software upgrade service, which guarantees free upgrades of XCAPI releases in our community. There are two ways to license your XCAPI. This enables XCAPI to be prepared for any type of hardware environment. If, for example, for security reasons, you use a server that is not connected to the Internet, you can still perform the licensing by generating the license file through our website with the help of another computer. For servers with a direct Internet access, we do recommend to use the LOD key directly within the XCAPI. This video will show you the two licensing options in more detail. The XCAPI licensing wizard will guide you and help you through the licensing process. In default view, you will find the wizard under licenses. If you use the expert view, the wizard can be started on the left side of the tree view. If you do not insert a valid license, the XCAPI will automatically work in demonstration mode using four simultaneously usable channels. Choose this option if you have a LOD key for your XCAPI license and your computer is connected to the Internet. Each license must be associated with a network card of your hardware. In this list you can see all the network cards that are eligible. In the next step enter the LOD key you received after the purchase. Our tip, use the copy and paste function to prevent input errors. Your email is needed to send you a copy of the generated license file. You can then save this file in a secure place. Finally, before activating your license, please double check all entries. In case that the XCAPI is installed on a server that has no connection to the Internet, you still have the possibility to license your XCAPI. 
just access our website www.te-systems.de slash license with another computer. Here you can generate the license file which is bound to your system. You need the LOD key, which is the activation code that you received by email after purchasing your XCAPI and the hardware ID that is bound to your network card. You can simply copy the hardware ID from the XCAPI configuration and paste it into the activation form. Don't worry if multiple hardware IDs are showing up in the XCAPI configuration, such as two MAC addresses from two network cards in the system. Simply pick one of the MAC addresses for generating the license. Just make sure the network card that is used remains in the system while XCAPI is operated and not deactivated in the device manager. If you use XCAPI on a virtual server, you can use the virtual ID for licensing. You will find the virtual ID in the XCAPI configuration. After the license file has been generated, you can download it immediately. A copy of the license file will be sent to your specified email address. Now, for example, you can import this license file with the help of a USB stick into the XCAPI licensing wizard. For the next step, please open the licensing wizard. In default view, you can find the wizard under licenses. In expert view, the licensing wizard is located in the tree structure. Choose the option Import License from a License File and select the License File to import. The details of the activated license are now displayed. If you need to move your XCAPI to a new hardware, you can apply for a license migration. Just contact our sales department. After successfully generating and importing the license file, please save your changes and restart all CAPI applications. You can check your license in default view. In expert view, you will find your installed license on the left tree view. Of course, faulty licenses can be removed easily.